Good morning, good morning, good morning, and welcome to the morning chat where I tell you what's on my mind in the morning time. How y'all doing? It's Thursday, and it's just one more day closer to Christmas. What is that? Three days to Christmas? Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and then, well, four days? Depends on if you count Christmas Day as a no, but anyway. Um, <clears throat> so, um, this morning, I usually I'm doing this as I'm driving, but, um, I had to stop and get gas. It was a whole thing. So, let's get into what was on my mind this morning. Early morning, early morning, as I was getting, um, prepared to come into work. And I was thinking... It seems that the end of the year of 2023, we're finding out that certain things, it wasn't what it was when it comes to relationships, right? So we got, it starts off with, I would say, it starts off with, um, Finding out that Jada and Will have been separated since 2017, allegedly, or they have been separated for years. Okay. I was like, what? So the slap, you slap that man over, tell him to keep your ex's name out his mouth? What was that about, Will? Y'all been separated. So the entanglement wasn't really in the... Y'all was living separate? Hmm. Okay. I'm just side note. That gives me tease. A lot of people are blaming Jada and saying all this stuff about Jada, but I want to say now, especially now in this uh, uh, um, environment, that Jada sounds like a beard that's tired of being someone's beard but she don't really want to out out him you know what I'm saying because she still care about him but she tired of being his beard okay she want to openly date other guys you know what I'm saying but she can't because she thinking it's bigger than them too but she's tired of it being bigger than them too <laughs> anyway um Moving on, then we find out that Remy Ma and Pat Poose, Remy then cheated on Pat Poose. You mean like the greatest black man of all. This is hood black love, yo. This man held her down during a whole prison sentence. Got married to her while she was in prison and then held it down. So when she came out, she came out to sign. And you lose, you, how you fumble with egg, ma? How you fumble with that? Now we hearing Cardi B and Offset is back off again. So it's like, yo, what's really good with the relationships? What did 2023 do to our relationships? Okay, what we gonna find out Beyonce and Jay-Z gonna separate? Okay, because we already didn't heard allegedly about Jay-Z being worse than, than than Brother Love. I'm just saying. You know what I'm saying? Is she gonna, is that, are we gonna enter 2024 with Beyonce and Jay-Z split? I'm just saying, the way these relationships, the black love is falling apart, yo. Yo! And then who else um, is having relationships issues? Oh, uh, what's her name? Uh, Tatiana, not Tatiana Ali. Um, girl and her husband. She filed for divorce. Uh, Tiana Taylor. There it is. Tiana Taylor and her husband. Broken up. Divorcing. 
You know what I'm saying? It's crazy. The relationships is falling apart. I wonder how 2024 is going to be. So, anyway, I'm here at work. And I'm sitting up struck on the struggle bus trying to see the time and see how much time I have. Because, I, you know, I still don't like the reflection in my glasses. But, you know, seeing is important. <laughs> um, I might have to get contacts so that I can still see and don't have that reflect. That bothers me. I understand now, Hollywood. But at any rate, since I got me a little four more minutes or three more minutes, but yes, it just seems like the relationship is just falling apart, yo. So, um, I'm single, so ain't nothing to fall apart. You know what I'm saying? But this is crazy. Crazy. Oh, I said we heard, I told y'all last night, Epstein's, um, uh, uh, associate list, the people that was associated with him is about to drop. Who gonna be on it? I'm just saying, this, this is 2023, Lord. Lord. Lord, Lord, Lord. Lord. Lord, Lord. I'm telling you, y'all, what is really good in the neighborhood, y'all. You see me looking around. I am parked at work. Um, just wanted to throw up this pre-recording. Anyway, I'm getting closer to the end. I might as well go ahead. So it looks like I only got, I got like two more minutes to do. But let me use that two minutes to say, hey, um, follow me. If you like my videos, follow me. Follow me, yeah. Follow me, Follow me eh, on TikTok. Follow me on Instagram and Facebook, according to Akara. I'm also on YouTube. Subscribe now. Come on. You can see all my videos. I also have a Patreon where I would like to set up uh, videos that we can talk. We can, I could talk, talk. You know, the allegedly's a little less than the allegedly's. You know, we don't say, you know what I'm saying? We can really kind of get into without breaking the parameters of certain platforms. So, I have a Patreon that's only $3. $3! Um, according to a car on Patreon, you join and I'll start doing the videos. And I also have the Intuitive Ones channel where I practice cardamancy, tarot reading, um, and numerology um, is the main ones that I deal with over there on TikTok. It's the Intuitive One. And on YouTube, it is the Black Queen, Queen Prophetess where you can uh, see the general readings for each sign when I do my readings. All right. That's all I have for you. Y'all have a wonderful Thursday and see you on Friday.